Alrighty, space out, space cadets. All right, guys, are you ready for, for this week's? Oh, also, also, here's a twist. It's not really a twist, but I think it is because it's not really like a thing we've done before. And the first HOH battle or competition, I guess you would call it. Mm -hmm. But are you guys ready to play this week's three part HOH? Oh, yeah, oh, three parts. Yeah. Three parts. I'm as ready. As I can get to bed by gosh knows. No movie! Whoa! I feel like it's always like super intimidating coming into a first session again because you're like, I don't know anyone. Especially for like All Stars, you have no idea who's like gonna be there, especially from like your season and or other seasons. So it's just like really fun to be back and like talking with people who I haven't talked with before. And it's like going to be super fun to get to know people and like see how they were in their season versus like how they are now. So coming in, I mean, of course, it's a completely different playing field. You know, I know familiar faces and, you know, unfamiliar ones. But at the same time, kind of got to start from ground zero, kind of build up again. Because, I mean, the people that I know from my last game, I didn't really do much with. And if I did do something with, I definitely did stab them in the back at the end for my own game. But, you know, it is what it is. It's been a very long time. But now that I'm back, it feels really, it feels really good. There's a lot of, fami there's like two familiar faces for me or voices for me. Update of me, um, I'm still the same. Um, I just go either Carlos or Jamie, or whichever guys you know me, then you can call me either or. I don't really care. But yeah, um, yeah, that's 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 about it. I'm so excited to be back because I haven't been in like any of these things since season two, which was filmed three years ago, and I am so like thrilled to meet everybody. I came into this expecting anything. Speaking on Closet Alliance that I mentioned earlier, I am super glad I'm not in the other house. I would not want to be in the same call as Jervy for that. I, being in the Closet Alliance was my biggest regret of last season. You know, I think I decided to do it because, you know, people decided to talk to me. So I was like, oh, I'll be friends with them. Not realizing, oh, everybody hates them. And the split house concept is super cool. I'm excited to see, you know, when we join houses, what happens with that. If there's going to be tension between the two teams. So coming into this house, I'm kind of looking around and it might just be me kind of not knowing who everyone is, but I feel like these people are getting on my nerves already. I don't have the same humor as them and it's kind of shown throughout how I'm just kind of quiet and I think that will like very much affect my game because I might seem a little cold but as of now I'm just kind of getting irritated by like all the corny jokes and stuff. I feel like these people in the side of my house I would never ever go ahead and talk to them or acknowledge them in public but that's just me. I really need to play very strong when it comes to making bonds and relationships. And that's just how I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling a little bit alone. And I feel like I really need to go ahead and grab somebody and just kind of anchor them with me so that I do have like a number one going for like going into this game. Now with the HOH, I really want to win it. 
I feel like since it is just six people on this side of the house for the first week, it's very dangerous to not be safe initially because that just gives you a way higher chance of going on the block as an initial nom and a renom. So I am trying to win this HOH. This is a three part HOH. I know, never been done before. There are so many competitions we could start with. So we thought, why choose each part? Two house guests will be eliminated. Oh, what? Ooh. Part one is going to be red light, green light. Part two will be lumberjacked. The final part will be hydro hygiene. Part one is red light, green light. And this is how it works. The street light in front of you will change to a variety of colors. When the light changes to lime green concrete, yeah, concrete powder, it will change when it's lime. You will have to sprint to the other side of your lane. The last to do so will be eliminated from the competition. The house okay. guest who is the slowest the first two rounds will not move on to part two. Are y'all ready to play red light, green light? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Ready to? Yes. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> No! Oh. This is dumb. <laughs> I don't want to be in the balcony. Oh! <laughs> so we gonna get, we gonna get green? No? <laughs> Just go, it's more fun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, cat. Can I jump over the thing? I oh. did, okay. Well, that's depressing. Alrighty, Joe, I'm sorry to say this, but um, someone was too eager to run. You are out of this round. Oh, that's rude. Well, maybe should someone should look at the colors. Why did I think that was green? Like, I was about to go. <laughs> Just do it. It's, I'm telling you, it's more fun. Focusing. Okay, that's purple. Okay. What if I was colorblind? What if I was red green colorblind? Um, this would be well. Kind of where? Then you would just be out, I guess. <laughs> I don't think Big Brother really cares about that. Prophecy fulfilled. Can I go live in the crystal shop? When this light comes on, I'm like, okay, first round, I got it. Somebody goes before me, so I know I'm going to be safe. And I'm literally the first person to step on the pressure plate. So I'm like, okay, I'm feeling confident. I can do this. And then the second round comes, I see the green light. I'm running as fast as I can. And I make the grave mistake of jumping and I miss the pressure plate. And it just irritates me because I could have been one of the first people to lock in. And it just breaks my soul that I am out of this competition. It sucks, but I'm just, oh, it irks me. <gasps> no, I didn't see Alrighty. you. Alrighty. <laughs> I'm sorry, but Miss Keisha, you're not getting my money. No. Actually, I don't think that was the, that was the vine, but you're out. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, part two is lumberjacked. And this is how it works. When I say go, you will unshift from the side of your tree. You have to stay on the tree as long as possible. If you shift at any point, you will be eliminated. Same goes for if you clack it and climb to the top or fall off the ladders. You will be eliminated. The first two to fall will not move on for the chance to win Head of household. Are you ready to play? Lumber? Yeah. Fucking jacked? Yes. Let's go for it. Yeah. Uh, 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 okay. I can't tell I like, if I'm doing this right. I like being shorter than the food truck window. <laughs> oh! I'm sorry, Carlos, but you weren't jacked enough to stay on that lumber. Ooh. You're out. Carlos. Get, get to that food truck and support me. I'm hungry. Will you let us know when there's going to be a ladder break thing? No. 
I, I don't even know what's gonna happen, so it's gonna be a surprise okay. to me too. <laughs> oh no, Danny, and move down. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> oh god. This I will say on. this was very hard to do with my nails on, okay? So I was fourth on season one, so I've already beaten that. <laughs> Feel, feel like your inner squirrel, just climb those trees, but not too high. I feel like I'm constantly moving backwards and it's scaring me. Miss Keisha! Miss Keisha? Miss Keisha? Miss Keisha? You said Miss Keisha. Miss Keisha? Miss Keisha. Miss Keisha. Oh! Oh! Danny! James and Zebra, you can stop what you're doing. It's on to part three. Randomly, the block beneath you will go out and in. Water will also rain from above, pushing you off your block. The first to fall off the block will be eliminated. So don't be fox and don't be a fish. Are you ready to play Hydro Hydrant? And see who will win the first issue of the season. Let's do it. Alrighty. Ready, set. Hydro. I mean, go. Uh, oh, I'm oh, sorry, James. Wow. But you just, you can stop now. You're out. So funny. And that means Zebra. That's it. That's it. You are. Uh, congratulations, Zebra, for winning the first All Stars H2H of the Summer. Ooh. Yeah. Yay. That was quick, you guys. <laughs> you guys, just let us know H2H room is open. Oh, 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 wait, can we go look at it? I want to go look at it. Yeah. Yeah, anyway, let Zebra go first. Gotta go in. Yeah, I don't know if it's themed or It is Zebra's room. Um. Oh, it's so pretty. There's nothing. Oh, I like the wall. Nothing that reminds me of my old season. I like your bookshelves. Thank you. Oh, those are fun. You know, you I want to do my diary. There's no bathroom. You guys should put little, like. There's no bathroom in this one either. So. Coming in, I mean, of course, it's a completely different playing field, you know. I know familiar faces and, you know, unfamiliar ones, but at the same time, kind of got to start from ground zero, kind of build up again, because, I mean, the people that I know from my last game, I didn't really do much with, and if I did do something with, I definitely did stab them in the back at the end for my own game, but, you know, it is what it is. I think everyone's really nice. I genuinely think that if I play my cards right, I could start making a little bit of, you know, alliances here and there. Winning uh, the first challenge definitely doesn't help my game because now that puts a big red target on my back. But at the same time, it definitely makes me feel a little safer knowing that I don't have to worry about getting eliminated first. That's my worst fear at this whole game. <laughs> uh, the twist about, you know, separating the two houses, I mean, I did not expect that to happen. At first, it was I thought it was teams, but you know they definitely threw that out the window. And I'm not really happy about that because I know people on the other side that I know would be able to help me out, would help my game so much. But I guess we'll have to see what happens. And I hope that you know I can make it out here alive. Of course, by merge. Today was honestly surprising. I assumed I'd be first or second out, but I made it up to the final round. I'm kind of glad I did not win that than Zebra did because I would not want the pressure of having to put somebody up already, you know, before we even truly know anyone. It's going to be interesting to see who he does put up though this week. Hopefully not me. I don't know. I feel like I really could have done well in the competitions and it just breaks my heart that I lost. So now with Zebra being HOH, I feel like this can go, I feel like this can work to my advantage because I feel like me and Zebra has, have already had a good conversation about our season. So I feel like he might want to try to work with me at least and try to give me the benefit of the doubt and keep me because I was an early boot on our season. So I kind of just want to play the pity card and be like, I really do not want to go out. I already went out second. It would suck to go out first. So I really want to play that card and I just really want to kind of form a bond with Zebra. That way, 
I'll be his number one and he'll think I'm his number one. But in reality, he's the first one to go when I'm HOH because I know how strategic and very not aware of how he kind of separates emotional versus gameplay. So he's definitely one of my top targets going into further weeks. And I just really need him to think that I am going to work with him. Everything has been going great. I mean, I I feel like I'm doing a lot better than how I was in the last season. But we're we're gonna see we're gonna we're gonna see what happens. I thought the comps were super fun. Loving the house designs. I think the two houses twist is amazing. And it's also gonna be very interesting because I feel like our house is a lot more mellow, like competitively, compared to the other house. So it'll be very interesting to see like how their dynamic is versus how our dynamic is going into what I'm assuming is going to be a merge at some point. I just got third place in the HOH, which is amazing. I am so proud of myself. I'm the only girl on this side of the house, and I'm only one of two in the entire house um, that, that I know of. Um, I don't want to assume, but that I know of. It throws me off a little bit. The, the twist is um, stressing me out, rather, because there's only six of us, so a third of us are going to go up on the block. and there's a very good chance I could go up on the block just for being simply on the top half of, of the totem pole for the for the HOH challenge. So I, I'm very nervous for that. And um, I don't want to go home first because that's what I did last time and I don't want to do it again. Although I'd already be doing better because I was 13th last time and I would be 12th this time. It's a, um, I just hope that merge is like episode two or episode three so i can like go meet the other house guests because i really want to meet new people and i am so friggin excited i hope these people are nice i hope we get to know them a little bit more before i get you know eventually you know the season ends or anything i'm so excited let's do this bitches <laughs>